Welcome, I'm Brianna and this is my life on paper and welcome to the 13th day of the 14 days of Christmas. Um, we are getting close to the end and as I probably said every video I can't wait to put pictures in these because I'm, I'm, I'm current on my Christmas photos but I'm making base pages and I'm very excited to use them. So the um, sketch that you would have seen at the beginning is from scrap a sketch that I, I you keep seeing from me because I love to use so the link is below I would encourage you to look at the Facebook group and and um, follow them if you're interested because the sketches are amazing so um, you'll notice the sketch has square photos that might be more like four by four but I um, am using things that I got from my advent calendar from my scrappy best friend Becky and I I'm using this all is calm all is bright card if the card was five by seven I trimmed it down a little bit this is from Echo Park and I am using these instead of the four by four that are that are matted so I've got my green paper I've got um, the white paper and then this is going to sit over here I have another photo mat for a, another five by seven picture and then with my Cricut I cut out the banner to match. And this, this kind of looks like burlap. It's kind of exciting. I, f I just found it in my stash. The other side is, well here, we can tip it over. A pattern paper that I probably wouldn't use. So this turned out really, really good. It was a, it was a lucky find on my part going through my stash. I think I might, uh, I think this one goes up a little bit. This one might come down a little bit. I want it to overlay the card. And then it's got two clusters, um, the bottom one with a title. So I found this in my stash. That's going to go there. And then this is a daddy about flair. It's going there. I have from, this is a creative memories. So it's going to tuck in there. And then this, I believe, is a paper studio. Well, this is from Becky. So I, it looks like paper studio. I'm not exactly sure, but I think I'm going to put that right on top. And then for the other cluster, it's going to go up here. I've got another flare. I've got another word, so cheer. I've got another flower that'll go on the flare. And then this is another piece from Creative Memories. So I've got the, the, um, the tree there. And look how, how perfect is that. So it's got room for a bigger picture. And if, if for some reason I didn't want to make a five by seven, I certainly could do more of a, well, you could do a five by five and with a little more place for the journaling down there. Otherwise there is the journaling spot down there. So this is going to be a nice quick one, which around the holidays is really good. Um, I have obviously one more day of the 14 days of Christmas that I'll be coming back with. Um, but for right now, I'm going to pause. I'll be right back with the finished layout. Welcome back. How is this for the completed layout? And again, quick and easy. Um, I did, so the, the paper is textured. It's got the bumps on it. So I did grab out the back of this. I, I, I got it, but I didn't go very far, right? I didn't, this is a 10 inch circle. And I believe this is a nine of circle. Yeah, listen to me. Okay, this is an this is a ten inch square mat, and this is a nine inch, which is totally does not look nine. It might look six actually. Okay, so I took six inches out. I could have went bigger. I don't know what I was thinking, but there you go. Um, I have plenty of paper, but um, because of the texture, I decided just to get that out. So I do have more of this paper actually too. Um, so I can work with it for the other side, which I think you, yes, you will be seeing um, for our last day of the 14 days of Christmas. Um, I'll make a companion page for this. So super simple, but I think impactful. And as I've been saying as well, you always have time and room to embellish more. So start with the picture, see how that looks and go from there. So be watching in January. I'm hoping to have all my pictures printed and, and doing a layout share um, with all the um, base pages that I've been doing and having pictures put in. So, all right. I 
Hope you have a fabulous day. Check out everybody playing along below. Give them some love and let me know if you have any questions. Leave them in the comments below. I love to hear from you. Um, thank everybody subs for, Thank you to everybody for subscribing and I hope you have a fabulous day and I'll see you again soon. Bye.